What's up, everybody? This is Jason 24CF here at Winter Bro with the man who does all the do modding for your sticks. So you could have one stick for both systems or three systems, multiple systems, as, as many systems as you want. This is the man that does it. So go ahead, introduce yourself. Your name is? My name is Matthew Gummo, aka Gummon, Bob the Builder, White Labor. <laughs> Things go on. And your partner on the side? Straw. What's up? All right, so Gum, I mean, first of all, how how did you get involved in this? Like, you know, it, it all started as a hobby back uh, like when high school. Uh, I wanted to become a programmer, make video games, stuff like that. But I also got into electronics. Uh, I got myself an arcade cabinet, Street Fighter Two Champion Edition, and I just did some crazy stuff with that. Like, I made a uh, I made a Game Boy Advance work on a on a arcade. So I play like Game Boy Advance games on and stuff like that. I mean, like, well, what do you have to do to make things like that happen? Like, it's gotta be crazy. You, gotta, you have to like think outside the box of what you can do. I like to choose a challenge, and just, maybe something simple, but that's one little thing that just makes it crazy, unique. And I go on with that. And I usually have like one thing where I have to, I have to figure it out. And I research, I go online, try to do it, and no matter what, I just I keep at it, and I eventually get it done. And I learn something new. It keeps on building on that. And then uh, it wasn't until like later on until Street Fighter 4 came out and I got back into fighting games. Right. And so I made uh, a big giant custom case. And it had to be a uh, wireless 360 stick. Okay. And, which is really rare because normally people would do a wire stick or something like that. So I basically just like jumped in and did like a really hard mod straight off the bat. So like, go ahead. I mean, give us an example of some of the things you mod when you do the dual mod and like, what does the process look like? Like, basically, there's tons of parts here and a whole bunch of other stuff. So like, here's one of your own customized here's sticks. A custom case. It's a. Uh... It's just a simple dual mod. It's got a 360 fight pad and a dual strike SMD board. It's the PS3. It's a board I, uh, I produce and make. And over here is a LED controller board made by 32 teeth called the Sparky. And it basically controls the arc eye LED board inside the buttons. And there's a little different effect. Instead of the normal basic, you know, press a button, turn the color on, it just it change colors. So like press more than one button, it's a different color. You don't mind showing us that what it looks uh, like? Yeah, sure. <clears throat> So it goes through the entire power up sequence. Yeah. All the colors. <laughs> you see, you press one button. It's red. All right, let's try to put a little more darkness so we could actually see this. There we go. All right. Now you press two at a time. It's green. You do three at a time. Change blue. And now, so, you're, and if you do like a throw, it's purple. Focus. It's like cyan. And taunt would be yellow. Yeah, it's nice. So. So that's something you do as well for if someone wants to say add LEDs yeah, to their sticks they, and whatnot. If they want to, you know, make it look nice and pretty, you do that. Uh, we got custom plexi. I can get their artwork printed out and put on there. And do you, do you just mod sticks? I mean, do you do I can pads? Mod, I, can do, I can do mod pads. I can do mod anything you want. Uh, so like, what pads have you done? Uh, those uh, like one is the. Fighting Commander 3. Uh, I'm the only one who actually has dual modded it. The first one. I can also do the, the trigger swap. That seems to be a really big favorite. Right. Uh, I can also do Sega Genesis. It still works on the Sega Genesis. Okay. So like Super Nintendo pads, you can do my Super Nintendo pads, any pads. I can also do Sega Saturn. I can also do children's toys like the V Smile. Oh, nice. And the Bop It. So like, so one stick. How many systems can you mod one stick to play on? As many as you want. So it could, the stick could play for the Wii, the Dreamcast, Super Nintendo, Genesis, PC. 
Uh, what else there is? Um, I can make it work for PS1, 2, 3, PC, 360, GameCube, Wii, same thing, uh, SNES, NES, Sega Saturn, Dreamcast, uh, Genesis, Turbo Graphics 16. Like any any system you want it to work for, you can get it done. Nice. So um, trying to think here, like is this something that you recommend somebody does themselves, or it's best they have a professional do it, like yourself? If, if you do not know anything about electronics or like that, it's best to get someone who does know do it. Uh, but it is fun. You learn about electronics. It's a nice little hobby. It's nothing too complicated to really get into. Right. But, if you really don't know and you're scared, it's better to have someone else do it. Now, because um, I know you do mod in my pad, and you had told me that you have like a basically it's your own warranty. It's like a lifetime warranty. So if something goes bad, they just send it back to you yep. and you repair it, right? So look at that. That's if even per. If they have a uh, problem and it's not their fault, right? I, I cover all the shipping costs. As long as they ship it, you know, fix it. Right. I'll cover the cost. Look at that. Like all my work. So, I mean, that's a, that's a great deal right there. So, I mean, you stand up. So, if it's something that happens, it, it's faulty on your end, you're willing to fix it and cover the cost of shipping. So, I mean, who wouldn't want to go to you? So, I mean, go ahead, give us your contact information so, you know, you could let people know. For those who don't know, because, I mean, everybody in the fighting game community who's been around for a while, they know you. I mean, let's, let's just take a look at all the sticks right there. You can move that chair real quick. So, I mean, we got one, two, three, four, five... Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, thirteen sticks alone. You're doing here today, so basically, you you haven't even got any games. You're just doing modding, basically. Yeah. Well, hopefully, I'm gonna play some games tomorrow. All right. Maybe if I'm lucky, maybe the gamer just allow me some free time. Yeah. Look at that. So I mean, go ahead, give us your contact info so when they want to hit you up and get their sticks, do modded. All right. Well, my email is gamon uh, at gmail.com and. Uh, Website is same thing, gumo.com. I'll right. take you to my SRK uh, thread for all my services. All right. And then for that, that's when they could get the prices for what yes. once what's done. Because I'm pretty sure you have like a, for my pad, it was $80, but for like multiple mods, I'm pretty sure you have different price ranges, yes. right? So, I mean, gum, appreciate it. Again, thank you for doing mod in my pad. Um, I got the PDB pad, which I'm going to give to you so you could experiment with that. But again, so everybody, this is Gummin right here, the dual modding expert, and hit him up when you want your sticks modded.